guys, Derek Aragwin here today, and what I wanted to show you here in just a second or two, it's probably going to be about a minute and a half, is how to disable your YouTube link in your video. Uh, as you can see here, I'm on my blog, and you'll be able to find this posting here. But really what this is, is if you use your, Google or your, your YouTube videos and you post it anywhere on the web, whether it be a landing page or on your blog, Sometimes you don't want people to click on the video or double click on it and be redirected to the actual YouTube channel. So as an example here, I want you to see that right now on this posting, I've got one video here and another video right here, and they're both the same video. But when I double click on this first video, it'll redirect me straight to a YouTube channel where the video will start playing. Now, it's not that, you know, that's not a good thing. If it's your video, then that's fine. But what happens if this video is on a landing page? You don't want people leaving your page whatsoever. So today I'm going to show you how to get around that. So now that we're here on this YouTube channel, we're going to grab the embed code. As you can see here, I'm going to go ahead and copy it. And then what I'm going to do is put it into a notepad because I'm on a Mac and I'm going to paste the coding. As you can see here, it's all inside. Now, what I want you to go is back to my blog on this actual page and you're going to see um, the steps. So first thing is we copy the embed code from YouTube. Second thing is paste. It should be paste, not passed. Um, we're going to paste the code anywhere on the web that we'd like, but we put it inside of the notepad. And then locate where it says in the code, allow full screen equals true. And so we got to find that. Okay, so let's go ahead and pull that up. As you can see here, here's the coding, and it's usually at the bottom, and you can see, oh, look, it says allow full screen equals true. Okay, we found that. And then step four says immediately follow the coding, or medi immediately follow that copy and put and paste allow networking internal. So I got to go back and reword some of these, uh, these, these words in here. But anyhow, you grab this part right here, and then we're going to go back into the coding, and right before with after true, we're going to go ahead and paste that in here and make sure you, you, you space bar too. That way there's a space at, between the end of the quote and with. And then after that, this is your code. Now you can grab this code and paste it anywhere on the web. And when they go and, and, and somebody's watching your video, whether it be on your, your landing page and whatnot, it will no longer take them away from the page that you want them to view. So as you can see, the first video here, it's actually, that code has not been disabled. The second one here has been disabled. And if I double click on this, it will not take me back to the YouTube channel. In fact, it just keeps me here pausing it and playing it, pausing it and playing it. So this is how to turn off the link built inside your YouTube video. Uh, this is Derek Aragon. I hope you found this to be useful. And you can see all this information and a ton of how-to information by going back to my blog, clicking on the how-to link in the category section and view a whole bunch of other cool things. Anyhow, I'm signing off. You have a wonderful day. I'll speak to you then. Bye.